Virgo. Welcome to my channel and thank you for being here for tuning in. I'm Valencia with Val 333 Tarot and with Spirit. And we're just going to jump right in here, Virgo, and see what's going on with um, you. <laughs> I'm like, woohoo! With you today, Virgo, okay? Um, this is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and the North Node. So, of course, it's not going to resonate with all of you. Um, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Sidekick Tarot, okay? And we're just going to start right here, Virgo, with some opening oracle messages for you. Okay, all right, Virgo. So we have impatience in reverse, forgiveness upright, perseverance sideways, quest upright, and victim reversed. <sighs> yeah, so two things. You either know you're in the wrong and you're playing the victim, or what I kind of get more is you have a right to feel how you feel you do feel victimized in a situation but you are sitting in it and dwelling in it for maybe longer than you should but then again that's your process and you do have your reasons right i do get the sense for some of you this is a quick message channeled message you are impatient to want to quickly forgive someone some of you are kind of like I, I get the sense that you're kind of like no i forgive you i, I gotta tell someone i forgive them but i can't I, i'm irritated and impatient like i just want to tell them but i can't there's that for some of you. For others of you, it's like there's an impatience here, okay, that you're really going like like beyond irritated, like you're ready to just go. But then immediately you're like, but you forgive yourself and the experience and the situation that you're, you're involved in. It's causing you to know you still got to keep going in life, right? You got to persevere and push through. It's not the greatest, but you're neutral with it and you're still doing the best you can. There you are on your journey, on your quest, okay? And the quest, the journey is making you feel like a victim, right? But like a little too far into it, a little too much. So we'll see with the tarot here what's going on. Ooh, hold on. There we go. Okay, Virgo, yes. Okay. Now, I do see some of you could be dealing with someone. Um, if you are, one of you is really not sure how to even feel or do or say about anything. And the other one's just kind of like sitting there totally cool. So either or. Now, for you in general, Virgo, I do see that at first you're like, I don't know about how I feel about what you, me, them, something. What the hell's going on here? And then you're like wait a minute, actually, I am connected. I do like them or love them or I'm having fun or I feel good. I feel like myself again, right? So either or. But then for some reason right after that, so it could be because of a person, I don't know. You understand that what you're going through may be toxic or karmic. It's something that you got to close the cycle and close the door on. Today, you're not ready to do that. You don't want to. You have your reasons and that's okay. Now... It's caused you to want to still work on day-to-day -day stuff and balance yourself out and figure some things out. And literally, some of you, you know, sign the, uh, I heard, okay, sign the lease, sign the court case, sign something here. So you sign something off, a write-off, legal contracts for some of you, in a very fair way, it looks like right here at least, I'll clarify. 
Um, others of you, it's court stuff. Others of you, it's just, uh, you know, maybe divorced, you know. Others of you, it's just you finally feel like okay again. Like life is feeling more balanced again. Things are going to get more like okay, better, more restored, okay. You're wanting to actually be fair and neutral in life, you know, with people, places, things. Okay. I heard in my head politically correct. So maybe you want to be that, you know, whatever that means. I don't know what the hell that means, but okay. So let's just jump right in here with the clarifiers, Virgo, see what's going on. started to hurt after something got cracked with you uh, the mystery the unknown the hidden got revealed something got pulled out of the crevices of your emotions and your soul in the depths it, it's making things very messy but at the same time you're gonna still be in it because you have to that makes sense but it's making you like mm -hmm. you know like oh what the hell but then also you're like whatever you know it's like a combination here Yes. Okay. So you know this is over. You need to end this with someone, something, but you're not going to. It makes you feel better to just stay for now. And that makes sense, Virgo, whatever this is about. It could be mother figure, father figure for some of you. It could be just you, yourself, boyfriend, girlfriend, whoever, you know what I mean? Friend, you know, family. I don't know. Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, to trust oneself, that's that's the most difficult part sometimes, especially when it's already confusing and it's like there's so much going on of emotions and thoughts and feelings. So you're not sure, do you really want to commit to yourself, to a path of faith, yourself, someone, but you're, you can't help but start to listen to that sick feeling in your stomach, you know, your chest hurts, your thoughts are like, wait a minute, that's starting to come up to the surface for you, you're starting to realize there's some things going on. But at the same time, you know, you could be someone that's open to like guidance or therapy and stuff. And so you're willing to kind of have like one ear open, but the other ear kind of closed off. But you're, you know, it's like today is just not the day to say hey everyone you know fuck you you know what i mean you're like you're like no 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 not today it makes sense virgo with whatever this is marriage relationships friendships you know stuff like i said something within yourself uh-huh uh-huh mm. friends and family reunions okay the party the celebrations now that looks like a good time people Friends, that, that looks actually fun there. For some reason, though, unfortunately, Virgo, right after that. Ah, well, oh, okay. Are you a special Virgo? Are you those? Okay, hold on here. Virgo, what kind of Virgo is this? <laughs> mm, are you my secret society, Virgos? I don't know. Uh, okay, two, there's a few storylines. One, if you're a special person. Okay, what I mean by that is like just a an orthodox Virgo. Like, uh, people might think you're, you know, evil and bad, but like you're not, okay? Like, I just group you as my secret society Virgos. Real quick, to my secret society Virgos. Uh, you're doing fine, okay? With what, you're gonna get what you want, okay? Get that contract, okay? It's in the good position. Now, be, and you, you just keep, 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 whatever you're juggling, whatever you're doing day to day, it's working for you. You're aware of that. That's why you're celebrating. Some of you are like, yeah, I, okay, I heard the, 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 what's it called? The pop the bottle, the cork, pfft, it's uh, the, the champagne because it popped off and you're excited to put pouring drinks. You're celebrating the fact that you, you may have got a deal, Virgo, or a contract or some. Ooh, this is important. This is a, okay. Hi, yes, okay, I just heard high ranking. Okay, I'm not saying no more. <laughs> I don't know who you are, by the way. Don't, 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 okay. Um, I'm for you. Okay, anyway, <laughs> so uh, this is specifically for this group uh, that I'm talking to. That's wonderful. So you know what you're doing, it's working. Okay, now the rest of you, if this is marriage. Uh, this is a, that you're in uh, a relationship of some sort and or uh, you could be having religious or spiritual battles with yourself through friend groups for some reason or society or people. But you're still, you know, working, you're still juggling and doing what you got to do. Sorry, or even if you're not committed to who you want to be committed to or what you are committed to, you're not truly about it. You're still, you're still figuring out and doing it work and it's working somehow for you. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. We're going, okay. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back to the, <laughs> back to the group I was talking about. Secret Society Virgos. Ooh, nice. Yeah, it, it's working. You, you, okay, all of you at the end of the day, how about this? All Virgos that resonate with this storyline, um, at the end of the fucking day, you're going to sign that contract. It's going to work for you. It's going to be perfect. A lot of you, the higher ranking Virgos, you got seven options that you're going to bank off of. And you know what I'm talking about? I'm not going to say no more. The options are people. But you know what I'm talking about. You're going to do well. <laughs> it works. <laughs> okay? Anyway, the rest of you, civilian Virgos. <laughs> uh, this is still going to work out. And you're going to do it in a right way here, I feel like. Because honestly, you're working so... Like, you guys are figuring something out in such a way that even justice is going to work with you. That's what I mean. Like, it's going to work. No matter what's going on here it's going to work for you okay whatever this is because you're doing the work this is going to work for you i'll leave it there um we have pisces cancer scorpio and libra and taurus energy okay is that about it yes all right that's a half for you thank you bye